because you don't get trained in a ton of leadership kind of opportunities. You know, I had experience, but I didn't have kind of structured faculty and, and advisors to kind of teach me a new way to approach problem solving and, and leadership. Now I have a vision of that that I didn't have before. I know what areas I need to improve in myself, and I know uh, some of the things that I'm quite strong on. And that's where it really came in helpful was actually how do I engage with different people who are different stages of their career? How do I make my point of view known without sounding like I'm trying to be too strong or forceful? And at the same time, how do I take people's critiques of what I'm doing without taking it too personally? How do I use that feedback constructively? How do I give people feedback constructively as well? To become more of um, a leader in that area rather than always being sort of the, the follower. That I, I have all these ideas but wasn't sure how to go forward with them. I was hoping to get some tools, you know, how do I do this, what do I need to do, what do I need to work on, uh, and also sort of networking, and that's what I was hoping for. And that's exactly what I got. This is tailored to, you know, our populations, our peoples, and so um, our problems are, you know, often cross-cultural, but we have some unique things that, that we need to address. Well, it was great to meet so many different people from different fields, and again, realizing you're not alone. Um, but also for me was to get an end product out, a deliverable that I could actually go home and use and, and keep track of my progress. If you're a new faculty, new postdoc, old faculty, I'd say go, you're going to learn something new, something you didn't know before you went there. And it's going to be positive. I think it's going to help you making positive changes back in your own career and back at your home institution and the people that you engage with. Mm -hmm.